My name is Christian von Königsegg. I'm 40 years old and for half of my life I've been on the quest to be a leader in the hypercar industry, utilizing Swedish design combined with visionary technical solutions. This is the uh, back end of our new Regera in the paint shop, getting ready for the Geneva Motor Show. Uh, we've just installed the uh, world's first fully foldable top-mounted active rear wing. With the one-to-one -one program, we pioneered the world's first top-mounted active wing. And this is foldable now to make it more elegant and to reduce drag while cruising when you're not looking for downforce or aero braking. So, um, all the other foldable wings we have seen on competitors' cars, they're lifted up by hydraulic pylons underneath. And these hydraulic pylons are quite heavy as they have to, with hydraulic pressure, actually lift up the wing against the Air Force. And uh, they're not that aerodynamic and maybe not that aesthetically pleasing. And they actually ruin a lot of the airflow underneath the wing, which is the side of the wing that really creates downforce. So we wanted to come up with a better solution um, where we don't ruin the aerodynamics underneath um, with pylons, um, where we don't need to rely on hydraulic uh, strength to hold up the wing and to air brake, but we, we use the, uh, the air force to also help uh, when aero braking. So first of all, it moves like this, and this motion going up and backwards takes much less energy than just pushing the wing straight up against the air force. Um, the other thing is, when we tilt this, we have this tongue going forward that helps the air push the wing here against the air pressure here. So we can have really tiny hydraulics as it's all the balance motion. And uh, these also act a little bit at high speed rudders. They're very aerodynamically shaped and they create very little turbulence and they act as uh, straight line stabilizers as well. So all, all in all, it's a much better solution. Uh, you can also see how far back the wing moves compared to the car. You want the wing as far back as possible to get as good le leverage on the wheels as possible. So not only does it move up, it also moves back. And there is a very good airflow underneath the wing here. So let's put it back down again. Like that.